Hello, my name is Ben and I am not a great gamer. Welcome back to Finland here in Banished. And when we last left off, we were in a bit of a situation. Um, I was noticing we were not getting enough fuel. We still really don't have enough fuel. So what I've decided to do, what I've realized is that the folks who do the uh, cutting of fuel, they spend most of their time going and trying to find fuel. Uh, they don't actually spend most of their time cutting fuel. They, 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 or they, they go looking for lumber. That's really what they need. They need a bunch of lumber, and they're not getting it. This is a bunch of hardwood, but I don't care. So one of the things I'm, I'm doing is I want to get a bunch of lumber back into the, um, back into the system. And so what I want to do... There we go. That's one less, um, one less farm field. You know what? How about a second less farm field? There we go. There we go. We need laborers right now. We need them bad. Uh, so what we want to do is we just want to shred all these trees. That's 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 thing number one we got to do. In fact, the other thing we're going to do, Forester Lodge, uh, no longer plant for a while. Just just cut for a little bit. So we're going to... Most of our... Uh, what are they called? Most of our laborers are going to be just cutting. Because what was going on was that People were wandering off, um, like the, the, the woodcutter here, I found him wandering off to find just just logs. He would get 10 logs, he'd come back, and he'd, he'd cut those 10 logs and be like, okay, well I gotta go like way far away to get you know 10 more logs. There's just not enough logs. And I think because of the size of the city, and because of the number of people we have, the logs just aren't being distributed very well. And actually, one of the things that I want to do... <clears throat> oh, we're low on... Bricks. Oh, you know what? There's a and a lot of this stuff, you know, being low on glass, being low on bricks, and all this stuff. A lot of that has to do with the fact that we're just low on fuel. So a, a lot of these things going on are issues with fuel. So we're we're trying to rectify that now. Just cut trees. Just cut a crap ton of trees, and um, we'll deal with it later. You know. Uh, the other thing we're gonna do is pick up. A bunch more. Um, get us one or two more uh, forester lodges. You know, get these going in. Um, that could be really, really helpful. Um, and and that will provide sort of a, a more sustainable, long-term sort of solution. Because we can't just you know denude everything and then expect to be able to uh, to operate like that. We gotta we gotta. We gotta have a, a stream of, of logs coming in. So now, what are you doing? Good sir. Well, you're, you're getting something to eat, which I guess is a, a co appropriate. We currently have, like, way more food than we could ever possibly need. Um, but, yeah. Okay, you got something to eat, now you're working. Okay, cool. Oh, there's logs in there. Okay, so you're just... That guy's actually working on logs. Okay, so now Quinn is working. The other thing we probably want to do... Did you just pick up blocks? No, you didn't. Okay. Find him, find him, find him. What is he doing? Is he going to pick up logs? Yes, he has ten logs. Now there's a... There's a market right here. And there are some logs there. So what we got to do, we just got to flood the market so there's logs everywhere. And that way they don't have to go very far. So speaking of my other plan to uh, plop down some uh, forester lodges, let's let's do that, actually. So I told my foresters to just cut for now. We won't be planting anytime soon. We'll, we'll, we'll figure that out. Um, we'll, get that, we'll get that back eventually. So where is the forester lodge? Um... Boundary. That is hard to see. Hmm. I'm wondering if we want to put it right about. Uh, let's, let's find here. If we want to put it, the new Forester Lodge, right about here, actually. Now there will be a, a thing in the way, a stream in the way. Actually, you know what we got to do? We actually have to clear this area. In order to do this right, we're going to have to clear a bunch of area to even just be able to see where the bridges have to go. 
Oh, you know what? Let's actually cancel a bunch of that. Cancel removal. Cancel everything on this side. There's only three laborers. Did people die? Yes, people died. The other thing we're gonna have to do, we gotta get more, um, we gotta get more residences going on. And the, uh, and the third thing we actually want to do uh, with the, the log thing is we got to, we have to upgrade. We have to upgrade a lot of stuff. <clears throat> uh, see here. Provides more warmth and larger inventory space. What more warmth actually means is that you don't blow as many logs heating. You don't blow as much fuel heating this house. Um, let me find someone actually who... We're going to start upgrading houses that have too few like decent uh, like breeding couples. So like you... Yeah, see 72 and 63. You're not going to have another kid. And that Shorman, he needs, he needs to go make babies or something. So uh, upgrade that townhouse. There we go. You, you're 48 and 55. Eh, I don't know about that. You're 67 and 51. You know what? Upgrade townhouse. Okay. I was hoping these walnuts would get tended to, but probably not. How are our chickens doing? Merchant has arrived. Let's see what they got. Coconut, chickpeas, parsnips, blah, 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 blah. Uh, nope. Not interested. Less of the green grocer. I appreciate it. We are up to our ears in food. Okay, so we do have people living in the coaching inn. That's not ideal. Yeah, let's upgrade this guy too. Okay. How are we doing on logs? 817 logs. Does that mean that we're getting more fuel? Yes, fuel is incoming. Okay. Now, what does that mean for you? Sand. Okay, how is furnace fuel going? Okay. Now, we can't increase the number of people making furnace fuel at this point without building a new building, which we may do. We may just go do that. Um, I don't know. That may be a thing to do now. Tristan Ford. Yeah. Some of these guys are going to have to get kicked out. Actually, though, the other thing that should probably happen... We should probably get ourselves... A couple more country houses. Let's do it, kids. Just build more houses. Just build more houses. It's just like the United States during the... Uh, you know, about 2006 or so. This is a great idea. Just build more houses. Just do it. Small market. Here we go. Um... Just that there. And let's road this up a little bit. Country road. Go to the side. Oh, interesting. I think that's house sticking out there. That's interesting. Let's actually cancel this building. Let's get a road going first. it up this way. Great. Now let's get a market. Get us a small market out here. One of the other issues that we were having was just a shortage of, uh, of storage space. We just had so much food taking up so much space that uh, there was no place to put anything. Uh, so yeah, it was pretty ugly. Uh, we have hit the clothing limit. You know what? What do we got for clothing? Hide coat 37. Warm coat. We got a bunch of warm coats. 
19. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna fix this problem a little bit. How about if we just have close limit, 500. Just keep going. I can't imagine anything else that we would do with leather and wool at this point. Besides just making coats. You know, that's, that's kind of what we do. We have zero laborers. Uh, huh. Yeah, people are just dying. Ooh, crap. Um, let's turn the farmer's way down. And another person just died. Okay. Uh, huh. Well, this is interesting. Just a lot of people are dying of old age, and we don't really have anybody to replace them. That, that, my friends, is a problem. That is a problem. Because another thing we're going to want is a large number of merchants to take all the logs that we're getting and distribute them property, properly. By the way, we do have one gemstone. Rough. Gemstones! We have gemstones. I don't know what we're going to do with gemstones, but whatever. Um, not enough firewood for the fuel refiner. Man. We're, we're at that problem again? Put one more person in the water wheel sawmill. Yeah, we. Somewhere along the lines, we did not build enough uh, houses. And that's really kind of what's going on here. Let's, let's, just for that, you know what? Let's throw a couple more houses down. Uh, not wooden houses. No more wooden houses at all. Uh, country house, maybe? Wooden houses use just far too much fuel, and we need to start conserving them. Um, start conserving fuel. So that's the thing. Anybody living at the coaching inn? No, because we don't have enough adults. <laughs> oh, and uh, how do we upgrade this? What does that mean? Oh yeah, fancy, fancy stuff. Now it's been a, a, about a week or so. So I actually forgot who. Um, oh, sweet, Killard and Miliana. I actually forgot uh, what kinds of things people were working on over in the sort of industrial area. Oh, wow, there's a lot of little question marks here. Not enough farmers. Eek. That's, that's pretty bad, actually. We need more people, which means we just need more... Oh wow, we st wow, we're down to zero laborers again. Um, okay, never mind then. We're hardly going to do any farming at all for a little while. Oh, this pasture needs to be built. Let's do some building though. So what are my people doing down here anyway? Well, they're, they're humming along. This is the homeware supplier. You're making regular homewares, not fancy homewares. Okay, good. What is the joiner doing? You're making regular furniture. Okay. What are you doing? Furniture and pottery. What is the potter doing? Making pottery, but it requires furnace shield. Okay. So that's really the problem. We just need a ton more fuel. Oh, people are starting to get cold. This is bad. Um, part of me isn't sure if these... Yeah. I know I see people doing stuff at this water wheel, but I'm, I kind of don't believe it. I just kind of don't believe it. The description of the product here. Let's find it. Let's find it. Refined resources. It says, a water wheel powered sawmill produces lumber or firewood and allows up to three cutters to work. Very fast work speed will use up available wood logs quickly. Wait, up to three cutters to work? Oh. That's interesting. Let's throw a few more uh, wood cutters in. We have tons and tons and tons of food. We'll be fine. So we've we've backed off on the farmers quite a bit. So just don't bother with that. I wish I could actually tell these guys not to grow. 
I mean, they're going to anyway. Just not grow, but still. Oh, do we have a pasture yet? Oh, so close. Okay. Now, where are my laborers at? Where are my laborers at? Yeah, still low on firewood. There's there are a ton of logs now. So what we actually want to do, yeah. So we've we've just upped the number of woodcutters by a ton. So hopefully this water wheel sawmill, dude. What are you doing? Okay, you are working. Do you have a bunch of logs? Yes, you do have a bunch of logs. Talonza, what are you doing? Talonza, you're crossing this field. You know, we're gonna actually erase this field. Merchant has arrived at the trading po post. Port. Trading port. Ginger, mulberry, leaf, bamboo, beetroots. No. It's just a bunch of food. I mean, it's mangoes. Don't get me wrong, it's mangoes, but still. I don't actually need mangoes. We're good. Oh, sweet. There's a bunch of logs in there now. This place has a bunch of logs. 30 logs. Look at that. 30 logs. Now just start chopping away, right? That's what you gotta do. Well, sawing away, I guess, which is different from chopping. But, you know, you know what I mean. People are still cold, which is really too bad. So how are we doing on the fuel refinery? Do we need more? I think we may need more. Is furnace fuel. Yeah, everybody's sort of out of furnace fuel. Let's check that. Yeah, we have zero furnace fuel. Okay. But we only have 79 firewood, too. Meanwhile, our population continues to plummet. Uh, population in this game is going to do a bunch of weird sort of swings. And what will happen is you build a bunch of houses, people will fill the houses, and then you'll have a big population group. And the next thing you know, you'll have, um, let's put people in a small market, that'll be great. And the next thing you know, you'll have, um, after the population boom is done, they'll, there'll be a bunch of people who are like 60 years old living, you know, taking up a bunch of space in your houses, and you can't get them out of there. Well, you can, but you have to pretty terrible. Uh, you know what, in fact, let's do this. Let's do this right now. Emil and Eudorathi, guess what? Oh wait, no, I can't do that to them. Actually, yeah, I can. Okay, upgrade! Now you, you let things kind of simmer down a little bit, and then you reclaim. Now, who comes in? Yeah, see, Bridge and Parmela. Sweet. Oh, oh, Herodon and Tian. Guess what? Oh, no, upgrade. Now you wait a little while. You too. Okay, now reclaim. Now, someone's gonna move in. Someone has to move in, right? Come on. Do we have any, like, birthing adults? <laughs> we just need adults to move in who... Yeah, here we are. Ernardo. No labor is available to replace- oh my goodness. We're down to 162 people. We were at over 190. Um, episode or two ago? So we want sheep here. Now we go over to our little sheep pen here, and we say, SPLIT! And I think they're gonna split, right? Yeah, they are. Okay. It says 11 of 23. So yeah, they'll split and they'll run wander off. Okay, good. Don't forget to harvest these guys. All these trees need to go. Oh, there's a lot of hardwood around. Maybe we should sell hardwood. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Now we don't have enough adults. Yeah. Okay. Because notice, uh, Corden, the farmer, is now alone. Now he'll shack up soon enough as soon as somebody uh, 
becomes, you know, comes of age. But still. Though, oh yeah, Arnardo. Yeah, we need a girl. We need a girl. There's gonna be a fight over these girls. Who's gonna be, what, who's the next girl gonna be? Oh, look at that sheep! Wandering through the forest. This guy's wandering across a crop field. Yeah, go to your, go to your new place. Go, go to your new place. Yeah. Yeah. Be happy. And uh, let us, let us just take some of your fur every once in a while. It'll be fine. It'll be great. So down here, I was planning on building a road and like a bridge or something over here. But I can't really see anything, so hmm. That's why I wanted to harvest this. Harvest this. I believe that's what I said to do, right? Harvest. Harvest this. There's a reason for it. I actually want it gone. Of course, it's because there's no laborers right now. I, we have none laborers. So what are you gonna do, right? Hey, we have real fuel going on. Okay. Our furnace fuel people are in fact, yes, they have firewood. We have 174 firewood going on. Okay. Okay. Corden, I don't know how Corden the farmer, oh Corden's a girl, okay, uh, had a child. But she had a child. You know what, I'm just not gonna ask questions. Just, I'm just, you know what? I needed the kid, you had the kid, here's a kid. Fine, we're good. Country house? I don't even know what kind of uh, building supplies and stuff we have. What's that barn doing? Oh wow, it's pretty full. Wow, it's a lot of stuff. What kind of clothing do we have? 162, you know something? Inventory. Warm coats. Let's find it. Warm coat. Let's make it 50. Also, hide coats. Where's hide coats? Where is it? Let's go to 75. Yeah. Tailors, do your business. Do your thing. Time to turn down the farmers again. Maybe. Everlyn, the fuel refiner has died of old age. Man. Uh, yet another person. We're at down to 160 adults. 160 adults. Crap. Oh, let's pull back on mining as well. We don't need this many, uh... We don't need as much stone. We have 3,000 stone, actually. We could really pull back on this a lot. We don't need stone. <laughs> Not like we need wood. And evidently buildings. And evidently just more people. We need more people. Make babies. I would totally take, uh, what are they called? Nomads right now. Trade. Cured leather. Kale seeds. Uh, can we trade kale seeds? Do we want kale seeds? Well, we want we want seeds. Seeds are good. We do not want a marble statue. <laughs> okay, we can trade a bunch of food though. Bunch of soybeans. Let's actually do this. Uh, Need an additional 125 things. Okay, well... One hundred and thirty squash. There we go. Overpaying by five units. Trade. Now hopefully seeds don't go bad. That would really, really, really suck. But there we go. And Bob's your uncle. Who lives here? You know what? I actually want to upgrade this house. You guys, be evicted. They were like 75 and some, or something, but okay. You know what? There is wood here. There's wood around. Oh wow, there's nothing in here. You know what, Esther and Manica, you're 80 and 67. 
Go, go find some firewood. We, we actually have it. It's fine. But, seriously. Just go do it. Okay, well I think we've kind of dealt with one crisis. The real crisis now is actually just... Um, what's the word? What's the word? There's a word for it. Uh, demographic. We just need more people. So... I don't know. Uh, oh yeah, Hiroshio and Laura. He's 85, she's 31. The problem with this is, uh, we're wasting her perfectly good childbearing ye years on someone who can't do the job. So, it's okay. The, uh, the virgin baby Deller is around. You know, we'll, we'll just keep having vir virgin babies. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Uh, why is Felicia a student when she's 21? That makes no sense to me, but... Okay. So yeah, we gotta, we gotta, oh man, we gotta deal with our uh, demographic crisis here. I think we're, we're, we're doing okay. We're having babies. And these nice country houses can sleep, I think, six. So hopefully JV and Ariel M.A. will uh, have more, more than just Viviana here. You know what? Close your eyes and think of Finland, all right? Just, just go to town. Go to town. Go to town. Well, uh, I think we're pretty good. Oh gosh, everybody wants, everybody wants fuel. Why is everybody cold? Why is everybody cold? Thought for sure, we'd we'd uh, we'd fix this. Thought for sure. We have 122 fuel. If people are low on fuel, it's really their own darn pro their own darn fault. So I don't know. So how are we doing on building supplies and homewares? Sixty-three homewares and fifty-seven building supplies. You know what? There's no good reason not to just upgrade a bu bunch of houses here. Uh, especially since Ernardo, the woodcutter, you're not even. Oh, hang on. Ernardo is a dude, and there's a girl over here who's living with a an eighty-six-year-old man. So we'll do this. And then let's... Oh, and then let's do this. Okay, so that house is upgrading, and then all of a sudden this house is upgrading. And actually, we will leave that house to upgrade. But this house, we're going to reclaim. Uh, reclaim. Now, watch Bernardo and... Come on, come on. Do it! Do it! Oh, come on. Bernardo. Doran, or Dolan, whatever. We need a girl. We need We need people to show up. Oh, Renato and Corden. Oh, sweet. Renato just moved in with Corden over here. Oh, okay, that's fine. That's fine. That'll work. It won't just be uh, Deller, the Deller, the Virgin baby. Uh, oh well, Stewardell is living alone. That's fine. That is gonna have to work. And that is gonna have to do it for this episode. Uh, oh, we gotta get Laura shacked up here. Um, let's get Laura shacked up. Um, but that'll we'll do that next episode. But this particular time, I enjoyed myself. Hope you enjoyed yourself as well. If you did enjoy yourself, please leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. And either way, I do look forward to seeing you next time.